watched your impressions of the way things went down there, the last that you saw from the dugout, without trying to get yourself in trouble? Well, I'm not getting myself in trouble. I uh, just was some people out there had some bad days today. And it happens in the game. They know who they are. Did you feel like what you had to say warranted the result? Yeah. Um, I'm surprised it didn't happen earlier. But, uh, you know, it just wasn't anything that could have went against us today as far as calls go. It happened. So we had some opportunities uh, to put some runs on the board. We just didn't get any hits and some opportunities. Um, you know, early in the game, we had a play at the plate. We just didn't execute that one. And you never know what may have happened. But once again, they put runs on the board enough to win, and we didn't. Derek, what did you think? Well, you know, he was competing. And, um, you know, I thought he threw well enough early in the ball game uh, for the damage that was done to, to not be up there. But uh, once again, you know, the top of the order did a good job. Reyes was all over the bag all day. Beltran swung the bat well against us. Um, they played well. They made a ton of defensive plays. They really did. Ball Moreland hit down the line. The ball that uh, T Garden hit up the middle. Uh, another one Moreland hit. The second baseman made. Michael Smack went up the middle. He made. Then we hit a few line drives, you know. But uh, there were some opportunities out there. It seemed like the fifth inning when you guys didn't score more than one run. That was huge. I mean, Michael had to make a tough call third, and then the kid made a great play. Kind of you know, I think the biggest one was uh, number one earlier when we scored in the first in was we scored there in the second. The one T Garden hit, heck of a play by uh, the shortstop there. And then the one that Moreland hit down the line, you know, would have tied the ball game up right there. But then we still had to go out there and keep them off the board. You know, it doesn't matter how hard you hit it, hits or hits when they fall. You know, I think the, the toughest one was the one that Murphy hit down the left field line. He just pushed at that ball and stayed in fair territory. That was after all the ejections. Huh? That, that was what precipitated the ejection. <laughs> Correct. Correct. Watch, obviously, every team in baseball is searching for consistency. It's the but when you have, um, when you go through spurts like you guys have gone through, does it make things more challenging as a manager when you don't, you can't really pinpoint exactly what to expect on a daily basis? Well, you know, it's always difficult um, when you put it like that. You don't know what to expect. I know what to expect. I know these guys going to come here and leave their heart out there on the field. It's just that, uh, you know, we just haven't put anything together for an extreme amount of time. And, um, you know, we're hanging in there. And I certainly look forward to uh, things getting better as the season get better. So um, all we can do now is uh, enjoy the day off tomorrow and come back in uh, Houston, see if we can get back on track, put some pitching together, put some defense together, get a chance to run the bases, swing the bat. Do you feel like you're missing a chance here to, to pull away? And it's not like the well, you know, the one opportunity got away was the other night when we blew the game. Uh, the first game against the Mets, we put runs on the board. The second game, it beat the heck out of us. And today, you know, there was some calls that could have went uh, in our favor. They didn't. But the thing is, is uh, you can't complain. And one thing you can't do is lose your composure. Still a lot of baseball left to be played. Reflecting back on the way that, that y'all have played so far this entire season and the injuries, are you is your is your one loss record? Are, are you frustrated by it? Or are you happy with it? Or, or? Well, I'm not happy with it because it could be be better. Uh, I think it's going to take more than getting to half a season to be frustrated. No, I'm not frustrated. Um, like I said, I've uh, been in situations where I finished the first half uh, under 500.
and ended up winning 92 games. So, hey, every day you come out, you try to right the ship. And um, if you believe and you do what you need to do to make it happen, it usually happens. And I believe, those guys believe, um, are we happy with where we are? No, because we know we can be better. But it's up to us to get better.